I grew up on a farm. My dad was a coal miner, and they, there were five children in the family, and quite often the mines wouldn't have work, so he bought the farm so that he could provide for his family. So we're in a tough spot right now because everything's falling industrial around us, and we're still agriculture, and we're trying to maintain it that way to try to farm uh, to make a, a, a living off it is very, very difficult. And uh, I'll hang in as long as I'm healthy and I can because I think it's healthy for you. You know, it's not about money always. It's about what you like to do and what you like to work with. So I don't raise the sheep for wool, I raise them because I like to raise them and they keep the farm, the weeds down and they fertilize the farm and you have your own meat and then you have a little bit of extra money. You never know what kind of a price you're going to get, but I love working with the sheep. And farming's healthy for you because you get fresh air and it keeps you active uh, you know you have to go out and feed the animals. You know you have to uh, gather the crops when it's time to gather them. And it keeps your mind alert because you're always thinking what you have to do next. You're never done when you're on a farm. And it's a good thing for family because you learn to work together. And it teaches the children responsibility. I guess the best thing about it is watching the sunrise and the sunset and just being at peace with everything. Hornhead will stay as a farm as long as I'm alive and then what happens after is God's will I guess. I just farm and love it and don't think about it dying around me but literally it is because people can't afford to uh, to farm <laughs>